Hey guys, it's Queen Deja, and in today's video, I will be reacting to the final episode of Slow Loops. Let's go ahead and get started in 3, 2, 1, go. I would have had this out by today. It still is Friday. Um, it's 10, but of course, this is probably not going to be done until 12, so of course, this is coming out tomorrow, so, yeah. Today was just a day for me. Ah. <laughs> mhm. Mm You don't have any new ones. Of course the last episode would be about, oh, let's make a photo album or make some pictures for Kaharu for her birthday. Of course, it would be on the freaking last episode. I don't want this show to end. I mean, I hate the fact that it's officially over as of today. But, I mean, this... This show really was a journey. It is a very, once again, underrated show that I think, due to depending on who was talking about it and stuff, so like me and a couple of other people, it did get popular. Um, for those who like, oh hey, slow paced anime, you know, slice of life, whatever. But um, as I said, I think what, last week, it didn't reach that... Um, expectation of laid back camp i feel like anything before or even a after laid back camp and that is by the same people of the kid of fantasy or kid the mug time kid something series um it's a little hard to find that you know quote unquote not kind of diamond in the rough or like the needle in a haystack where it's like oh hey this is peak and such and this is popular as fuck that it's gonna get a second season i mean this is the same people who made the demon girl next door and that's getting a second season i'm so freaking happy that is but i mean this has been a ride i am sad that this is over even though we haven't watched the episode completely but still i don't want this to end <laughs> uh, okay Baby. Baby is like, it's not perfect. Oh, no! Oh, that was me today. No, are you gonna cry too? Oh, babies! She was crying. <laughs> oh god, it's like when you when you see someone crying, you start crying. Oh my god, poor babies. <laughs> oh no. Stop. 
top of my heart. I needed this today. <laughs> oh, babies. <laughs> you guessed. Okay. The type of Okay. But hold on, when you're wrapping it like that, don't you think you would need a, um, like a knot to secure it? <laughs> I can't. Oh my god.
look at the colors of the leaves. Hmm? So what is it, like a fishing competition or something? Of course it is. <laughs> Within an hour. Holy Jesus, mother of God. Within an hour? Bruh. Well, you know, unfortunately, one of them ain't in the TV, so I wonder what the others are. Oh. <laughs> they all want the vacuum cleaner! <laughs> You got this, Yori. She would be thinking about food at a time like this. <laughs> I go, oh my god, baby. You just in the wrong place, babe. Unfortunately, no. Oh. Mm -hmm. Come on. <laughs> well, baby, unfortunately, it's not working for you, but, um, A for effort. Because she want that body to <laughs> Hell, I don't blame her. I will want it to. Swimming away.
just girlfriends being girlfriends and teaming up with each other. Mm-hmm. <laughs> hmm? It looks like a baby though, right? Or is that just me? Mm-hmm. Do you not have her phone? So wait, hold on. Who won the body pillow? Congratulations, Koharu. Heck, it looks good. Koharu is too proud about what she made. Damn, already? Aww. Oh, it's cute. Yeah. <laughs> Poor baby, she learned something new today. Go on, he wadi. You know you want to.
I want that body pillow so bad. <laughs> oh, God. Mm-hmm. She might think that you don't care. See? Because you didn't give her her birthday gift. Mm-hmm. Well, yeah. But you can make new memories with them. Mm-hmm. Alrighty, so final thoughts on this show. I really, 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 oh, <laughs> really enjoyed this a lot. Like I said, this was a damn good show, and it was very sweet, very educational in some things, because, you know, at the beginning of this 12-week episode series, you know, I'm not a person who's into fishing. By the end of it, I'm still not into fishing. So, did it change my mind? Probably, probably more, like, at the halfway point of it. Like, saying, hey, maybe one day I might want to do it. Just to, you say, hey, I tried it. Um, just how, like, when I finished both season one and season two and laid back camp at the two different times when they both aired, I was like, yeah, you know, maybe one day I'll camp. But, you know, I'm still going to camp outside of my house so you know i got a balcony i'll camp out on the balcony i'll be fine like that you'll be like yeah yeah yeah, yeah. i can't because like i said i'm not going somewhere where i have to go to the bathroom and it's an outhouse no that's a big old no no i i love these three so much of course koi is best girl hiori comes in at a close second and even with the fact is that Koharu is in last place, that does not mean she was worst girl. She was still best girl overall, just like all the rest of the girls who I didn't mention and stuff. But this was such a good, interesting series. Hell, it made me laugh, cry, and everything else in between. I always enjoyed coming to this, whether there were days when I was coming home from work and I was exhausted or I waited until the next day to do it just to get it done or I was waiting until Sunday to get it done. 
I really enjoyed this a lot. I hate the fact that this is over because it felt like it just started like just I cannot speak. It just started yesterday and it feels like, you know, there could have been more to this series. But, you know, unfortunately, I'm guessing due to many things because it wasn't getting as popular as Layback Camp or the demon, um, the demon girl next door or even new game expanders to it possibly getting a season two. I could kind of still see it getting a season two, but it would have to probably be like a couple of years in the future. I would like to see these characters come back. I would like to see the Seiyus who voice these characters to come back and to have like a, a better opportunity. I would like to maybe see like an OVA for this show if they possibly have it. I mean, hell, it could be in the works. I don't really know. But I really enjoyed having, like, going on this journey with a lot of people because this was one of those shows that, first, I was very skeptical about because I was like, yeah, it's cute girls doing cute things and the cute thing that they're trying to do is fishing. But by the end of it, like I said, I really, really, truly enjoy these characters and this world and learning more about the world and the characters so much more that, like, they felt like complete family to me by the end of the show. And I am really, truly going to miss it. It had, you know, we had a wild ride with the show. Truly. There, I think, you know, Hiori, not Hiori, Koharu is very similar to Laura from Tropical Rouge Pretty Here because of her expressions. I feel like there will be no other character from now to the end of the year that will have expressions like this child right here because Laura was the queen of expressions last year and now our new queen from this year is Koharu because her expressions were just godlike and she was just doing it week after week after week for me like even when I was done watching the show I was sitting here busting out laughing over any little facial expressions that she made because almost everything every little facial expression she made was like a fucking meme and you'd be like yeah let me put that down let me put this down but other than that guys that is my reaction view towards the entire series of slow loop if you guys enjoyed it please give me a like it really helps me out also subscribe to my channel I make videos every single day join the natural squad and of course I will possibly see you guys whenever if this show possibly gets a season two and I will see you guys in the following weeks for the start of spring anime. But until then, I will see you guys all next time. Bye!